Shit, no worries. Oh, I don't know. Someone said density. He abused me? So? Oh. No? Yeah, I'll delete that shit. Sorry. Ouch. You should not do... You should not to do... I don't even know what the fuck he's doing. I wasn't aware of that either. That's awful. I knew this could become a handy. Yeah, I'm sorry, bunny. I didn't realize the extent to which you didn't want that shit in here. What the fuck? How are you not aware of this? How else do you know his relationship with me? Honestly. I honestly didn't know it that deeply. I was just making dumb shit and density sounds like a funny word. I'm sorry. And then, I know you two fell out. I know that his fans harassed you a ton and continue to. No excuse. Really, Lartrek? That's all you know? What else is this crazy fucking bitch thing I actually did? What is, is she actually trying to pretend that I like abused her in real life or some shit? What, el what else Anna, is please. there? What? Sorry. Pick a card. Pick a card. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I'm really coming up with some really creative stuff now. <laughs> Pick a card. Yeah. <laughs> Donating to a millionaire? <laughs> you know how wrong you are? Don't be so stupid in the chat. We got somebody in the chat says, Donating to a millionaire. <laughs> God, you're so fucking stupid. It's multi millionaire. Multi. We will see if we can. But we have to find, we have to find a guest who doesn't know that I'm not talking like this all the time. Right? We can do Texan. We can do both of them. We can do Texan. We can do Indian. We can do a combination of the two if you want. Right? Because Dr. K's from Texas. I don't know if y'all realize that. Thank you for the subs, Buttered Loaf. Dr. K may be moving to Texas real soon now. It's been too long. Do Dr. K's been in the north where it's cold, north of the Mason-Dixie line, where it gets very, very cold. WoW used to have, like, a resurrection debuff. Yes. And, like, when you had the res debuff, like, do you remember, like, what happened to your stats and stuff? Yeah, they, they, uh, they got, they got reduced by a lot. Like, a, a shit ton, right? Like, 90%, like, yeah, 90%, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, and so what happens if you, like, try to do, like, a raid and you have the res debuff? You feed and you lose. Okay. So what I think is going on with you, Mitch, is that you are playing the game of life and you're losing catastrophically over and over and over again. And you basically have a res debuff that you're not aware of. Oh. That's what, a good analogy. What do you think about that? Uh, I think I got to wait 10 minutes and queue up again. Yeah, but that's the thing, right? So you don't. So 10 minutes is not how you actually get rid of the res debuff in real life. You actually oh. have to get rid of that debuff. I mean... <laughs> Put this thing here! Put this thing here! Make it trans- Make it transparent! Make it- Make it transparent! <laughs> Look at them all. <laughs> so it's a day where we celebrate fat people. In Sweden, we have only one day. In America, all days are for fat people. In Sweden, it's one day. No, I'm kidding. Uh, oh, that was so mean. I'm sorry to all Americans. Sorry, but uh, we have one day where we. We have one day which we call like fat day and it's tomorrow. Alan looks like okay, I guess. Like next time, can you get me like a matcha fat? <laughs> Go sit over there. Go sit 
face not cute but cute voice. I hate you. Put a one in chat for me. Kill me. Kill me. Hello? That that is true. I do need help. But the an, another issue that I do have is I will find these people in my life that will paint themselves as the perfect help for me, right? And instead of actually giving a shit about trying to help me, it will almost always be them being selfish and trying to get something from me. And I always feel betrayed afterwards. And it makes me literally feel like humans fucking suck. And I just, I just fucking give up. You understand? Like, I have had a fucking issue with, like, trusting people that paint themselves as this almighty savior for me. And, like, it, it, it just fucks me time and time again. Like. The remainder of the sentence acted you saw that? as a model prisoner. Just 14 years later, in 1961, what? he was released on parole. And for the first time in a long time... What the fuck happened? Cool. What the fuck happened? No! Okay, chat. So, you guys remember my cousin, right? The one that I did the fundraiser stream for? You, you guys remember him where I raised $1,500? I did a shitload of shit to raise money for him. Well, um, he had to go back to the hospital recently. Um, and you know, it could, he had bowel problems. It could have been anything, you know, small, big, we didn't know. And, and uh, when they, they tried to repair the tissue, it kept breaking. Different parts of the tissue kept breaking and they... They said he has two weeks to live. And... Oh, fuck. Fuck, <sighs> I wouldn't cry. Oh my god! Oh yes! Oh! Woo! 284! 284! Oh yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy fuck! This is... This is brutal! This is totally brutal! It's like a whole... You guys have to go through a whole lot of chit chat just to get your... Your dick sucked? I feel sorry for you guys. Man. No wonder you guys are mad at the homos. You guys are homophobic because you know we got it easy. That's why you're just jealous. You're pissed. You know, I mean, I can tell you right now, I can go into any steam room in any gym, in any town, doesn't matter which town, big city, small city, you know, it doesn't matter which country, you name it, and I can get my dick sucked. 